The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial Trade up 115, NASDAQ down 24, S&P's off 7. Gold, gold contract uh, down 460, trading at 1959 an ounce. We had seven. We had uh, silver up 17 cents, 25 dollars 12 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck 51, trading 75 dollars 38 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds, the 10-year note down 16 ticks, trading 112.17. The 30-year off 26 at 126.12. And king dollar, king dollar. Where are you, baby? Up 215 ticks, trading 99,986. The Euro 112, the Yen 138, and the British Pound at 130 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&P first, folks, bottom line. You get a higher price, you're closing at a higher price, and guess what? Yeah, yet, you know, pull back, uh, what, 28 cents today? <laughs> That's it. <laughs> so, you know, this market's not done yet. That's the bottom line. You know, you're over these highs and you're over these highs. Volume on, on a weekly basis was uh, 354. The last high was 394. The high before that was 367. We take a look at the Qs, the NDX 100. What do you have inside the Qs? Put this on a weekly basis also. We're way over on price, that's for sure. So your last high out here was uh, 372, your 379, bottom line, you know, you have to get a lot lower. You have to get below that 379 for anything to even happen, for any selling to actually come in. We go look at the, the T-bonds, the T-notes, rather. What we have, excuse me, folks, what we have with the, the, the big moves out here this week were the T-bonds, T-bills, and the dollar. You can see the T-bond, T-bill, they're back inside the range again. That's saying that... Higher price is coming at us, lower yields are coming at us. And right now, on the yield front, on the 10-year, we are at 3.8. The high last week was 4.6. And then, of course, King Dollar. And uh, I suspect what we're going to have with King Dollar this week, you're going to get a little bounce of King Dollar. So we'll get some good feedback from the market next week as King Dollar tries to do a dead cat bounce. And we'll see if the market, as King Dollar is doing a dead cat bounce, if the market pulls back with light volume, that is setting up a higher market, and it's also setting up a lower King Dollar. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Come back and visit Tommy Monday morning. Kicks us off 9 a.m. Go get him, folks.